back to my channel today I have another video for you guys um, and this is my review of the Koji San skin lightening soap so y'all know y'all know that I like to be trying different stuff to see if these stuff really work or if they're pretty much just telling lies in these videos that I'm watching. So I decided to buy this Koji Sam. And really and truly, I wanted to buy it for a while, but then I'm like, it says skin lightening soap. I'm not trying to lighten my skin. I just want to lighten my scars so on my face. So I'm like, okay, you know, let me try it because I was watching several videos with this Koji San and people in the comments saying they're not trying to lose their melanin or whatever. You know, they just want their dark spots to be gone and asking questions like, will this product lighten my skin? And the people are replying and they're like, no, it won't. Um, it won't lighten your skin, you know. You still have melanin, it's just, it, but it will definitely get rid of your dark spots. And I'm like, you know, that sounds a little too good to be true. A little too good to be true. A lit, a lot of too good to be true. So I decided to try it myself. So. I was going to come on here and really drag this Koji Sam soap, like really drag it through the mud, like drag it through the mud. But then I had recorded a previous video when my face was like really bad. I don't know if y'all have acne, but people who have acne, like my acne is menstrual cycle acne. Like I get breakouts every time of the month, you know? and. It is so annoying to every month have to be dealing with this. And it's like, I'm like, you know what? I need a solution. I need a solution to the problem. And then sometimes it's like, I tell myself, don't pick your face. Don't burst the bumps. Leave them alone. Don't scratch them. Don't touch them. Leave them so that they don't leave another scar in your face. But then you know what ends up happening? The bump ends up popping like you. Ac I accidentally touch it and it pops and it leaves a mark. Then I'm back to having a mark on my face. <laughs> After getting rid of all the marks on my face, I'm back to having another mark on my face and it just starts all over again. It's just so frustrating. So I'm constantly trying to find things that work. I mean, I have a routine that works with my witch hazel and my apricot blemish control uh, scrub. I'll probably do an updated, um, oh, hold on. What is that in my mouth? Anyways, I'll probably do an updated skincare routine video. You know, but, um, Surprisingly, surprisingly, this Koji San, uh, yeah, I don't, I, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. So I'm going to give you guys a review, but this review is like a I don't know type of review. It's the whole truth, nothing but the truth, but it's a I don't know if to tell you go and buy it or I don't know if to tell you stay away. So I'm just gonna tell you my experience so that you can decide for yourself if you wanna stay or if you wanna go, if you wanna buy or if you don't wanna buy. So I use the products for three weeks, right? I stopped using the product because your girl, your girl's skin was starting to look a lot of texture a lot of texture a lot of texture i don't know if it was opening my pores i don't know if it was killing off my skin cells you know i don't know what this soap was really doing so i stopped using it because i'm like oh, what is going on and then um one of the videos i watched they were talking about like putting this putting this soap on your face for like 20 minutes and letting it sit for 20 minutes don't don't do that 
please don't. Don't do that. Listen. I put this soap on my face because this is how, this is exactly how I did it. I took a cotton ball. This is how the soap look. It has two bars in here. I got it on Amazon. Um, so this is how the soap look, right? So I didn't want to waste it. So I wet a cotton ball and I pass it on here. And then I take it and I pass it on my face or whatever, right? And then your girl attempted to leave this product on. But like after a minute, I was feeling like my face burning, like burning, like a burning sensation. And I was like, okay, maybe, maybe this is what it does. Maybe it's working. Maybe this is what it does to work. But after like a minute and one second, I was like, mm, 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 mm. I washed this thing off of my face, girl, all inside my nose. Look, I barely, I don't even know how the product get like inside of my nose, like right here, like inside. I don't even know how the soap get there. I guess when I pass it on my nose or whatever, I don't know. The thing went inside my nose like right here and look, it literally left a scar like inside my nose it, and when i say scar i mean like you know when you have a cut like you throw water on it it stings like that like you it's not a visible scar unless like i could see it i can't see it but i could feel it's there so it left a scar and i was like okay we're gonna have to bring this koji sun uh, down to like 30 seconds because I'm not trying to burn off my skin and I am just going to avoid my nose because your girl is not trying to you know so I ended up putting the Koji sign directly on the scar which is this scar here you could probably still kind of see it you know and that scar right there and this scar right here when i put on makeup i don't be trying to hide my scar because when i take them off you know i don't want you to be like whoa oh my god i thought you were flawless girl no i still want you to see my scars that way you know i have scars but um this is the scars that i was trying to like fade away a little bit they were really bad, okay? They were really bad. So I'm going to show you right now how they looked and how they look after two weeks of using the Koji Sun. felt like it was drying up my face I and mean, then even if I use moisturizer or whatever I just felt like my face was getting really dried and really textured so I just stopped using it and that's how my skin was starting to get like without makeup without makeup that's how it was starting to look to me like I was like mm -mm. <clears throat> mm -mm. I need I need that glow, <laughs> you know, when I wash my face and I go in the sun, I need that glow on my skin. And this product was kind of taking away my glow. So, no, we were not having that. So I stopped using it. And right now, I have the other bar. I have the next bar too. I mean, it's still like, I got a new one. I still have it. And I was like, okay, probably I'll try it like on other parts of my body that is not as fragile as my face um and kind of see like how it will do but um that's my review for koji sam so like just don't be listening to all these videos talking about leave this thing on your face for a long time don't do that don't do that okay leave this thing on your face it's a soap it's not a mask it's a soap. So last time I checked, soaps, you just pass them on and you wash them off. But I have people out here telling you leave these things on your face for 20 minutes. And this thing, how it burned my face for like 
a minute I could only imagine what it'll do. I wasn't trying to bleach her skin, you know? I love looking like a chocolate cookie. I wanted to get rid of some scars. But anyways, that is my review on the Koji Sand, guys. Um, you could buy it <laughs> if you probably want to text your face. <laughs> and um, if you want to take out all the glow in your skin. You could probably buy it and it does kind of fade away the scars but then with fading away the scars it does that too you know like you you could buy it but i wouldn't be like oh my gosh go on buy koji sign like i can't tell you that because i stopped using it because it's just not i just don't think it's I just don't think it's worth it. It's best to like use something natural like vitamin E oil or something. I haven't tried that either, but I will be trying different stuff on my channel to see what works and what does not work. But for me, this is my review on Koji San. It is what it is. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope this video, I hope this was somewhat helpful. Somewhat helpful. Okay, and if it was helpful in any way, go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my channel because I have lots of other videos coming. Oh my gosh, I am so hot. Like, whew. Okay, see you guys in the next video. Bye. <coughs>